Hey, what is going on guys? Roger here. Welcome back guys to Forza Horizon 4. Now in today's video guys, we're going to be building the 2015 Porsche Cayman GTS into a streetcar. So the reason why we're building this thing today is because a man of mine the other night was driving it with a wide body kit and he did a couple of flybys and I reckon this thing sounds fucking pro. So we're going to build this tonight. Tonight. So we're going to build this today and uh, yeah, let's get straight into it. Almost got a bit intimate there anyway. So this thing stock 340 horsepower, 280 foot pounds of torque. Weighs 2,965 pounds, and uh, it's fairly rear heavy, obviously, because you know it's re-engined. And it's got a 3.4 liter in it. Alright, so upgrading, we have engine swaps, we have a flat 6, and we have a V10. I'm not going to chuck those in, because this thing sounds too pro. Can make it all-wheel drive, that's stupid. Uh, is it turbo already? I guess not. Bullshit, it's not turbo. No, it's not, what the hell? Alright, we have to make it turbo then. Um, wide body kit, rocket bunny kit looks absolutely amazing on this car. Boom, uh huh. That's it, looks fucking pro. Spoilers, we have the Forza spoiler and we have the uh, rocket bunny spoiler, which looks sick and it's massive, but we're not gonna do that. We're going for like a clean build today. Tires, I think we will just leave the stock ones, which is sport anyway. So we'll leave them. Our uh, tire width will probably make it. Shit, you can go to 295s on the front. Yeah, we'll do that. On the back, it's already 265, so we'll match it up. 295s. Uh, rims. Now, this is like a really prestige sort of car, so we're gonna have to put some nice rims on it. Those look pro. Yeah, we'll go with these. Oh, the 20 inch rims already. Um, we'll just leave it then. On the back, it's probably 20s as well. Yep, alright, we'll leave it. Max out the drivetrain. So I have already built this thing once. Um, I did just chuck on the white body kit. I didn't max it out, but so that's why we're doing this today. Uh, I just wanted to, you know, see what it looks like and shit. Um, so race brakes look like they're useless. This is the smaller. Yeah, fuck it. We'll leave the stock brakes. Screw it. Um, looks better. Um, and we can go rally and we can go drift. I think we'll go rally because I think, I don't know if it still does, but it should put more offset. Um, or should we just go with the steering lock and put drift? I think we'll go drift, fuck it. Both the anti-roll bars. Um, we're probably not going to put a roll cage because this is like a... Uh, we could, it looks alright. doesn't look very fitted to the frame, but... Now we won't put it in, fuck it. Uh, race weight reduction, and then we'll max out the engine. So 409 horsepower with the turbo. Alright, so now it's got 678 horsepower, 500 foot-pounds of torque. And it's now a 4 litre as well, so that's without the turbo. Now with the turbo, we get up to 767 horsepower. Right, that's pretty sick. That's good enough for me. Let's uh, tune this thing up, paint it, and then we'll go for a bit of a dose. Alright, so tuning. This thing's got a 7th gear, man. Look how long it is. Fuck. Um, so we don't want all that camber, because it looks a bit weird. But like, 1.8 and then 1. Leave that shit, leave that shit, leave that shit, and slam it already down. Do the cornering and shit, the downforce, that's pretty sick. Um, and then we'll lock the diff, that's it. Damn, there's a lot of stock colors, man. All these colors look pro, man. I don't know which one to choose. Um, probably have to go with that special color, actually. The yellow looks pretty good, too, actually. Now, nah, fuck, I would do this color. And then rims, we might make it white or chrome, one or the other. I think we might have to go with black, to be honest. Black looks the best. Might be matte black. That'll probably look better. Yeah, definitely. All right, matte black it is. That's it. We're done. All right, this thing is pretty much tuned. I don't really like how it's sitting, but because the rear is still kind of high. But um, I'm pumped to hear this thing. All right, so I've never heard this thing in real life, so I'm not sure if it actually sounds good. But in the game, I know it sounds fucking professional. Look, it actually looks fucking sick. It looks sick, too. The interior looks pretty good. I like it. I can feel it just wants to go, which is pretty sick. It's got the electric wing going, that's pretty sick. Oh shit. I think sounds and looks pro, man. I'll get night time, but I got the rev underneath there as well. So much pop. 
Alright. I will smoke it up. Oh, maybe a launch. That sounds pro. Right, so I just smoked the tires up like a professional because fucking still got the sport tires. But it sounds pro. Off the rev level, that sounds so good. Listen to that shit, what the hell? <laughs> Gonna have to go in the tunnel for this shit. Um, how much boost are we running? So a brake boost to third gear, 15 pounds. Twin oh, single type actually. Once again, I reckon this is one of the best sounding cars in the game. The crackle, the pop, everything. I'm gonna have to rev it in the tunnel. Fucking gunshots, that was pro. This thing sounds so good at the high RPMs, man. I have to shorten that seventh gear, but that's annoying. Make this all line up a bit better. Alright, that should be good. The drifting? It sounds so good off the rev limiter, man. Oh my god, I'm spewing. Alright, so we maxed out. I gotta lengthen it a bit. This thing has a drift car would be so sick, man. It sounds pro. Oh my god, I can't get over the rev bang. In, inside view. But anyway guys, that's going to be it for this video. If you guys like this video, please hit the like button. If you guys are new to my channel, please hit the subscribe button. Let me know what cars you guys want to see next. All my social links are in the description. Thank you guys very much for watching. Zerosian out. Yeah. 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 Yeah.